its survival, any kind of weapon is going to help. Ideally a rifle. But if you're stranded without warning, you're unlikely to have one of those. Sometimes, though, nature throws you a bone. Or in the case of Montana, a stone. I just found this. Found this arrowhead back there. You know, some of these date back literally thousands of years. Would have been shaped and made by Native Americans. to use them to hunt with and to protect themselves. Native Americans used bow and arrows to hunt deer, elk and bison. And if it was good enough for them, it's good enough for me. I've gathered some feathers and willow for the arrows and alder for the bow. It's all about tools of convenience. Using whatever you can around you just to help yourself hunt and survive. First thing I want to do is just strip this willow down, take all of the outer bark off. Next, to attach the arrowhead. The central thread of my paracord's ideal for the job. And then just melt down some of this pine resin. And then mix it in with a bit of charcoal. Makes a really effective glue. The feathers must be placed carefully. If not, the arrow won't fly straight. You see the rifle on that? And that's what gives it the spin. Okay, time to make my bow. Just tapering down one side of this. And then in between doing that, just get it over the fire and try and dry it out. And that's going to stiffen it up and then give it more power. More parachute cord makes my bowstring. I should have a range of about 15 yards. So we're ready to go. Go on. Then. So just trying to keep all movement nice and slow, no sudden movements. When you're moving jerkily, the animals catch out the corner of their eye. Bow hunters would normally actually often scout an area for months in advance. Once they find a good area, they'll come and they'll wait, and they'll wait. But I don't have that luxury of time. We'll give it a bit longer. Move out through this woodland bit. If we don't get anything, we'll then move on. Then suddenly I spot something in the trees above. Him on the top branch there. Got him? It's a long shot. The bird's tiny, but I've got to give it a go. Oh. Went straight over his head. I try again, but the second arrow scares him and he flies away. No luck this time. Survival is all about playing the odds, and you'll often have setbacks before you succeed. So try, try, and try again until your plan works out. The one thing you must never do is give up. Especially where we're going next. It's back to the tropics and into the jungle.